Deputy President Rigadi Gashagwa can now breathe a sigh of relief after the High Court in Nairobi issued temporary orders blocking their arrest. Now, detention and uh, prosecution. The trio includes former Nyeri town uh, member of uh, Parliament Ngunjiri Wambogu, ex Mbakasi West lawmaker George Theori, as well as uh, Pius Monene, who were to face several charges in relation to the Gen Z demonstrations, which saw over 60 Kenyans dead and mass destructions of property, which according to the Interior Cabinet Secretary, Professor Kindiki Kithur, was a plan to unconstitutionally overthrow President William Ruto. According to High Court Judge Lawrence Mugambi, there is no need to detain the three for lack of evidence in relation to the case presented, though issued orders against the Directorate of Criminal Investigations, DCI, as well as the Office of the Director of Public Prosecutions, ODPP, further directing the petitioners to file and serve respondents in the case within seven days. In regards to the matter, the three politicians had moved to court claiming that they were made aware of a plan between the respondents to arrest and prosecute them over what they termed as trumped up charges while appearing before the National Assembly Security Committee Interior Cabinet Secretary Professor Kidure Kindiki claimed of evidence against high-profile individuals and politicians linking them to Gen Z protest in June and July this year. Informed by DCI that high-level prosecutions will ensue any time from now, of including political leaders who financed, and we have evidence they financed people to loot shops, to kill Kenyans, expose them to danger, and we cannot countenance the kind of uh, um, mayhem we saw in July and, uh, and, and June for whatever reason. On Thursday, the Office of Director of Public Prosecutions, ODPP, approved charges against five allies of Deputy President Rigadi Gashagwa. A statement from the Office of Director of Public Prosecutions indicated that they were charged with conspiracy to commit felony. Further, the ODPP directed that an inquiry file to be opened on money laundering and financial crimes as well. This year recommended charges against Member of Parliament Benjamin Gadiru of Embakasi Central, James Gakuya of Embakasi North, George Theuri and a former Member of Parliament Embakasi West, former Nyeri Town MP Wungu Njiri Wambugu and Gashagwa's Private Secretary Pius Munene after conducting thorough investigations. Sauti ya uhuru mwegai kenyata wale wako katika mamlaka hawange kuwako. Lekini leo tunauriza bona unataka the charges they face including soliciting or inciting others to commit an offense under Section 391 of Penal Code, conspiracy to commit a felony under Section 393 and money laundering under Section 3, 4 and 7 of the Proceeds of Crime and Anti-Money Laundering Act. Elizabeth Mutuko, TV 47, Nairobi.